Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to uninstall Advanced System Care from your Windows device. So this program is often bundled with a lot of other software, so there's a very good chance that you might not have necessarily wanted it installed when you installed it, or maybe its usefulness has passed and you just want to remove it from your machine, which is perfectly fine. And for whatever reason you want to remove it, we're going to just address that in this video. So you want to search system care. Best match should say advanced system care 10 or whatever version you're running. You want to right click on it and then left click on where it says uninstall at the bottom of this menu. So left click on uninstall. Should be something that will open up in programs and features. This says advanced system care. You want to left click on it and then proceed to left click on uninstall right here. Left click on uninstall at the bottom of this window. This will begin uninstalling Advanced System Care 10. If you get any open windows, it'll give you a survey on, that they request that you fill out about why you're uninstalling their software. And then sometimes there might be other bundled software with it as well. So this dash lane, you could do the same thing with it. I believe it was bundled with the Advanced System Care as well. So if you wanted to remove it, you could as well. Not saying you would or would not, I just remember that this was bundled when we originally installed Advanced System Care. And I'd always recommend checking your programs to see if there's any weird applications in there, just in general. Doesn't mean that they were installed when you installed System Care. It just means sometimes it's good every once in a while to see if any programs slip by your watch and might have been downloaded very conspicuously without your knowledge. So just be patient. And once that is done, you can pretty much close out of any applications you have open. I'd recommend restarting your computer to better get rid of any remnants of the software, especially if you wanted to reinstall it. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.